Hello, idlers. This is your colonel speaking, and um, I have tried and tried to make this video um, like three times now, and something happens every time. <laughs> something different happen different happens every time, and I just and the video does not work. So today we're going to try a beginner's guide, uh, starting with. Uh, daily quests and um, we're gonna go through those right now and uh, I'll give you a few little tips and suggestions along the way and um, we're going to do a part two as well that dives a little deeper but uh, for now we're gonna go to all the way to the left side of the screen and um, we're gonna start there because I'm English and that's how we read and write. We read from left to right. It just feels feels like the right thing for me. So, this is what I do. So, starting on the left-hand side, we're going to go to check-in here and get our uh, daily check-in prize. Today it's a Dragon Slayer uh, shard, I guess. Um, next, we're going to go to check our mail and we of course get our daily reward and um, and I do have a mini monthly and monthly card going right now um, I got those at a discounted rate I believe the uh, the mini monthly was a dollar ninety nine and the monthly card was um, well the senior privilege card I guess it's called now um, was I believe eight ninety nine something like that um, so those are great introductory offers. If you've never gotten those before, I would suggest you get those um, just for the, um, you know, the, I, I think, I believe they'll get you to um, to VIP too if you buy those together, but uh, possibly you may have to buy more, I, f I forget. At any rate, um, so I, I, ch I do my mailbox Next, we go down here to the uh, friends list, so get our hearts and um, scout. You should scout as often as you can every day. It'll get your spirit, uh, gold, uh, hero promotion, stones, etc., etc. Sometimes, of course, you will find a marauder, and then you can fight it and um, get points, get prizes that way as well. And as you can see, it refreshes every eight hours, so uh, check that every eight hours. And we'll talk about that more later. So next, um, I go to the tab in here. And um, so, and of course, I, I am VIP three or four, I think. So I get a lot of uh, missions. If you don't have this many missions, if you don't have seven missions, that's because you're not uh, VIP yet, and that's okay. Um, so, uh, so these here below are ones that I did yesterday. So this is how I do I do my my tavern quests. I just um, I start them today. I'll start I'll start all of these today, and I just leave them until tomorrow. And so then they're all ready to go now, and I can complete my uh, daily quest now. So I'm going to go ahead and take this, and this, and um, and the way you, and you can save these back like this, you can just, uh, if you save them as complete and don't click the yellow button here like I'm doing, it will just stay there indefinitely until you uh, press the complete button and finish it. So, um, so as you can see I have a lot of uh, quests saved back um, down here. I'm trying to fill up my uh, I'm trying to save up 25 star quests and um, my sixes as well and I just completed I just used my two seven star quests yesterday and so I don't have any of those but I am saving all of these back that's what I do. I save 20 of the five star missions and at least um, at least five 
or is it six of the six star missions in order to uh, complete the event when it, the monthly event, uh, tavern quest event when it rolls around. Um, it just reset recently for me, and so I've already completed that, and now I'm saving up for the next one, and that's how you do it. But uh, I don't really like any of the offerings here, so I'm going to refresh for 70 gems. And there's a nice six star mission, we'll take that for sure. And, um, and by the way, you can't complete six and seven star missions um, unless you have a six star, um, no, that's not right, seven star missions. You need, seven, uh, you need six stars to complete the seven star mission. So if you don't have a six star, get one as soon as possible so that you can start uh, completing those seven star missions. They are essential, and uh, of course we'll take this five-star mission for gems. That's great. Uh, I don't. Oh, and look, we got a seven-star. Oh, that's delicious. Very, very nice. So that's one of us. One of our two seven-star missions uh, for the next monthly tavern quest coming up. So that's beautiful. Excellent. Okay. I don't like any of these others. Um, so I'm going to refresh again for 40 gems, and uh, I will take these um, three-star missions if they are 25 gems or more. Uh, they can be up to 30 gems, I believe. So I I'll usually take them when, uh, for 25 gems or more. Um, we're going to pass on this one for 21, and I don't like any of those. And there's 25, so we'll take 25. Um, the reason you refresh like this every day is... Um, we'll take 24 as well, because we're not having really great luck here. Um, oh, there's 30. That's very nice. And then, oh, and we have one of these to use, so we're going to use that as well. And um, the reason you refresh every these gems every day... It, it might seem wasteful, but generally you will come out ahead, gems, if you keep, um, keep fishing for gems here. There's, there we go, 94 gems, perfect. Um, but, but the main thing is you want to re, you want to refresh as often as possible so you can get these seven star quests. You got to get your seven, your two seven star quests every, every month. And they're very important. So the more you refresh, the, high, the more your chances of pulling one of those out. Anyway, we're wasting time. So onto the marketplace. Um, these are the these are the ones I buy every day. This one, all of these heroes here, including the four star here. Very nice. And lastly, I buy these scrolls, these uh, basic scrolls um, for, for gold. I used to not do that, but then they came out with this um, with this challenge, the new challenge that's like pull one five star hero from a basic summon for 200 gems. So, so now I do those. I, I buy those for gold. Um, I absolutely do not buy the. Um, this one for 10 gems, forget that, um, and um, occasionally I will buy the, you know, you do need to buy your, your 8 scrolls for a thousand, um, I'm, I, so I, buy, I do buy those from time to time when I can afford it, and sometimes these um, 8, for eight uh, wishing coins for 240 gems. Um, and anyway, we'll talk about that in the next video, but um, now we're going to go and get our Hand of Midas. I like to do the free and the 20. Uh, that, that completes my daily quests. You can do the free and then wait for it to refresh in 8 hours and do another free one if you want to go that route. Uh, that'll get you your daily quest as well, but um, I just like to get them both done here. I rarely get the 50. Uh, the 50 gem one, it's probably worth it, but I just, I just don't like to get it. Just personal preference. Um, at any rate, moving on. Uh, 
these are your uh, free videos every day. You get five of them for a total of 100 gems. You want to get those, uh, watch those every day. I'm not going to bore you with those right now, though. I will watch those later. Uh, next, we're going to go to the Wishing Fountain here. And the Wishing Fountain has uh, three tiers of gold. So right now I'm on 125k, which is my low tier. Uh, there is a 250 tier as well, that's my mid tier, and then my highest is 375k. Uh, since we're on the low, uh, the low one here, I'm going to use my free refresh. And we're still on 125, so bummer there, but um, we'll go ahead and do our two free spins. But if it isn't on the low uh, one here, if it's on you know, my mid tier, that's fine. I won't refresh. I'll just go ahead and spin. And uh, that's, you know, you want to maximize your gold here uh, when you're spinning two at a time every day. So we did that. And uh, next, um, we're going to go up to Celestial Island here. We'll get all of our loot here. And um, go up. Let's see, it looks like I have, got, I have a boss here. So we'll do that uh, later. And then smash these islands as well. Um, next. And, and those, by the way, those are fresh every six hours. So... Um, you want to make sure you're hitting those islands, uh, you know, every so often to get your rewards there. And next, we're going to go down to our guild here. So, um, go check the mill. We're good there. And the raid. Oh, we do have a raid. So, um, I'm not going to bore you with that right now either. So, I'm going to come back and do my raid later. And, um, oh, and we didn't get our coins, did we? Check in there. Very nice. Okay. Uh, so we did the Wishing Fountain, we did the Guild, and now we're going to move to the Summon Circle, and we're going to get our free Basic Summon. And I'm also going to do a 10 Summon while I'm here, just for fun. Nothing great there, that's fine. Now, on Heroic Summons, um, you do need to do one per day to complete your daily quest. However, uh, I only use my summon when I have a free one every day. Unless, of course, it's like this week when we are uh, in the heroic summoning event. Um, so, so I only complete my daily quest every other day. This is something I learned from uh, my friend Wrath of God. Um, so check his channel out. He has a lot of good tips. But, um, so I will give full credit to him for this tip, but um, using using a scroll on the on you know every other day when you don't have a free one is just a waste because you're only getting a hundred gems for full completion. Uh, I'm gonna show you here. No, it's not challenge, it's quest. Okay. So you're only getting a hundred gems here up here for the for full completion every day. And a heroic scroll costs you 125 to 150 gems. Uh, and so you're really just throwing away gems there uh, by doing the non-free uh, summoning every day. So I only I only complete my heroic uh, summon every other day um, because of that. Because of that. But today we are gonna come back and spin uh, 40, 40 more to complete the event today. And that will be in, in another video, though. So we'll come back to that. Campaign. Uh, we get our loot here. And then we have to tap the green button fi five times. Seems kind of silly to me, but it's just what you have to do. So we do it. So there's two. There's three. Four. That's right. Die. And five, okay. So there we go. We did our five of those. Um, and uh, oh, do we have a Murata over here? No, nope, we don't. Um, so next, um, I do like to just hit seal land. Uh, just so I don't miss it. 
just go ahead and smash, get my smash done every day, just so I don't forget. I like to do it along with the daily quests. And then we go to our blacksmith, and uh, we're going to forge. And you should just forge everything you possibly can in here every day. Don't save anything up. Um, you should have enough every day to um, to do to do. You'll have at least three things you can forge every day. So don't go ahead and save them up. I actually did save up boots on one of these for for a few days, and um, it took me forever to to finally forge all that stuff once I decided to do it. Um, that stuff just gets so backed up. So don't don't save. Uh, don't save these things. Just go ahead and forge everything you can every day, and the end you'll be good. You'll be jolly good. Anyway, um, there we go. So that's done. And lastly, we do our event raid. And I like to buy my. I d I am VIP, so I like to buy my max number of these every day. And, um, so we're going to blast through these. And this, oh, look at that, grand prize, very nice. Um, double rewards there. So, um, I d so it, this, this is definitely worth it, those extra ch tries every day, especially at this level, at the last level. Um, you know, you're getting extra four stars every day, so that's nice. And now we're going to go do this one really quickly. I don't buy extras on these because, you know, really, I know you, ha you always have enough of these things, as well as gold. Um, so we'll do two of those, and we are done. Finished with our daily quests. We're going to check these out here. So we're all done. And you, I know what you're going to say. You're going to say, but Colonel, you didn't do your arena battles. And that is true. And let me tell you, so, let me tell you why. I actually do m save my arena battles for the next day. I'll do those tomorrow. Uh, because um, the arena resets every day. At, for me, it's around uh, 2 o'clock. And that's when your arena prizes are given out, your daily arena prizes. So I like to do my arena battles around one o'clock or so, uh, an hour before the, the uh, arena resets and prizes are given out. Because if I did, if I do my arena battles right now, then that gives people, you know, 18 hours or so to beat on me um, until prizes are given out. And so if I do them now. Um, I'll get beaten down, and then I won't get as good prizes from the arena. However, if I do, if I do my arena battles, you know, like I said, an hour, hour or so before the prizes are given out, then my score will be higher and I'll get better prizes. So that's what I've, that's what I try to do with the arena, and so I won't complete my daily quests until tomorrow, and that's just fine. I'll get better prizes from the arena. That's my tip for today, and I uh, hope those help, and um, remember, as always, karma can be a bitch, but she is lovely, isn't she? I think so. Anyway, this is your Colonel signing out, and um, I will come back with another video here, uh, completing those heroic summons uh, that I talked about, so I will see you then. Thanks. And then we'll do part two of the beginner's video here uh, later as well. So thanks for joining me. This is your Colonel signing off. I will see you next time.